Yeah, he's a black Trump supporter, man. Are you a Trump supporter, man? Listen, you know he's he a congressman. Are you a black Trump supporter? Yes, he is. He's in Congress. He speaks he's not in Congress. What, what, what is your position? For Trump. He's been on Congress. What is your position? Wait, fuck this dude. What, what is your position? Then fuck this dude. Nobody doing nothing wrong. Just move it. Back up. Move back. Move back. Move back. Hey, right here, Brad. Right here. Fine, right there. Oh, you fucking out all the you doing now? You spoke at the orange, right? I watched you speak. Let, let the man walk. It's Brianna Taylor. Can you say her name? Let the people walk. Let us live. 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 Let Representative Vernon Jones from Georgia. And I'm just here just thinking about and playing over and over again in my mind about what happened 
when we left the White House, after the president had given this great speech on his record and what he had accomplished for this country the first four years and what he wanted to do for America the next four years, only to be met by a violent mob of supporters of Joe Biden and Kamala Harris. These were Democrats, Black Lives Matter, Antifa folks. And what they were doing and the threats, and by the way, let me be clear, my life was threatened and others' lives were threatened. And when I hear that foolishness from the liberal media, that it was mostly peaceful, where in the hell were they when my life was threatened and others' lives were threatened? Thank God for those police officers because had not been for them, I don't know if I would be talking to you now or any other time. And when I hear Joe Biden and the Democratic Party and Chuck Schumer and Nancy Pelosi and Kamala Harris turn their backs on law enforcement, they are out of their minds. And where's the liberal media? Why haven't they reached out to me and to others and allowed us to share our experiences, the threats that we experience so the American people can see firsthand what happened? But they won't because they support with the Democrats and Joe Biden and Kamala Harris destruction our cities. They want to see it demolished so they can blame it on Donald Trump. If this had been the other way around and Biden supporters were, were attacked by Trump supporters, it would have been all over the network. But that's okay. You and I both know there's only one person and one force that stands between chaos and community, and that's Donald Trump and his leadership. So let's be a part of that solid majority. If you're black, white, Democrat, or Republican, let's go and elect Donald Trump and let's save America. Hello, America. My name is Vernon Jones, and I'm a state representative from the great state of Georgia. As you can see, I'm a man of color, and I'm a lifelong Democrat, too. You may be wondering, why is a lifelong Democrat speaking at the Republican National Convention? And that's a fair question, and here's your answer. The Democratic Party does not want black people to leave their mental plantation. We've been forced to be there for decades and generations. But I have news for Joe Biden. We are free. We are free people with free minds. And I'm part of a large and growing segment of the black community who are independent thinkers. And we believe that Donald Trump is the president that America needs to lead us forward. This is no time for sleeping in the basement. Joe Biden has had 47 years to produce results, but he's been all talk and no action, just like so many of the Democrats who've been making promises to the black voters for decades. We've been their captive audience. When President Trump sought to earn the black vote, the Democratic Party leaders went crazy. Nancy Pelosi and Chuck Schumer literally started wearing kente cloths around the, the, the U.S. Capitol. As if pandering were enough to keep us satisfied. Let me tell you why I'm supporting our president. I grew up in the South, in Laurel Hill, North Carolina, Scotland County, the Green Pond community to be exact. My parents, Robin and Rufa Jones, built with their own hands a four-room cinder block home with no indoor plumbing. They had very limited education, but they instilled in us a strong work ethic that drove me from those tobacco fields of North Carolina to those hallowed halls of the Georgia General Assembly. My parents taught me if I believed in God, worked hard and treated every person fairly, there was no limit to what we could achieve. I attended North Carolina Central University, an historical black college. For generations, HBCUs have been the incubators that developed black scholars in math and science and religion, engineering and politics. They have been important springboards for the black success. But Democrats haven't treated them that way. When President Trump took office, he changed everything. 
He delivered historic funding to HBCUs and he guaranteed it for 10 years, something that has never happened in the history of this country. That gave our HBCUs stability, the chance to grow, and produce the next generation of black leaders. That's right, Donald Trump did that. He's also supported school choice to ensure that no child, no matter their race or zip code, is left behind. Every child should have access to a quality education. But education is just the beginning. The president also built the most inclusive economy ever with record low unemployment for African Americans and record high participation in the workforce. He put opportunity zones in the Trump tax bill that would drive investment into our communities for decades to come. He put the interests of American workers and especially black workers first. That's right, Donald Trump did that. He delivered historic criminal justice reform. He ended once and for all the policy of inc incarceration of black people, which has decimated our communities caused by no other than Joe Biden. Democrats wouldn't do it. Obama didn't want to do it. And Joe Biden and Kamala Harris definitely wouldn't do it. But Donald Trump did it. He's also working every day to make our community safer. As a former executive of DeKalb County, Georgia, I directed one of the largest public safety departments in the Southeast. I seen tragic shootings on both sides. Officers killing citizens and citizens killing officers in the line of duty. Police officers are our fellow citizens. They live in our country. They have families too. They live in our communities. Unfortunately, Democrats have turned their backs on our brave police officers. They call it defunding. And it's a danger to our cities, our neighborhoods, and our children. Isn't it ironic that Democrat politicians have personal security to protect them? So why don't they forego their security and replace them with social workers, especially since that's what they want for you and me? Our police need more funding, not less. For frequent psychological examinations, for non-lethal remote restraint technology, and for more de-escalation and use of force training. These are the common sense solutions that President Trump supports. True, sincere police reform. That's right, Donald Trump did that too. Education, jobs, safety, security. On issue after issue, and in just a single term, he destroyed these negative forces that have victimized the black community for decades. He gave us the opportunity to rise. Now, you know, when I made the public announcement of my support for President Trump, all hell broke loose. I was threatened, called an embarrassment, and asked to resign by my own party. Unfortunately, that's consistent with the Democratic Party and how they view independent thinking black men and women. But I'm here to tell you that black voices are becoming more woke and louder than ever. The Democratic Party has become infected with a pandemic of intolerance, bigotry, socialism, anti-law enforcement bias, and a dangerous tolerance for people who attack others, destroy their property, and terrorize our own communities. That's what this election is all about. And that's why right now, more than ever, more than ever before, America needs Donald Trump in the Oval Office for another four years. God bless you and vote Donald J. Trump. Thank you. Dr. Lee? Dr. Lee, how bad is it this time? It's not good. His heart just can't support his weight. He's asleep now, but he doesn't have much time. I'm very sorry. 
but there's really not much more we can do. John, wake up! John! John, wake up! John, come on, wake up! I thank God every morning for allowing me to wake up, and especially for what happened next. Because miraculously, what happened next took my life on the most dramatic and unexpected turn possibly imaginable. And although this story is painful and embarrassing to tell, God's given me the courage to do so because what happened next led to a breakthrough discovery that not only saved my life, but could very well save yours too. A breakthrough discovery that has proven what the real underlying root cause of excess belly fat, unwanted weight gain, premature aging and disease truly is. And as you'll see, it has nothing to do with genetics, diet, or exercise. A shocking discovery which led to a simple after-dinner ritual that incinerated 59 pounds of health-destroying ugly belly fat in just weeks, which left me barely recognizable to my friends and family and even to myself when I walked by my bathroom mirror. Going from this to this. Yet more importantly, rescuing me from the imminent life sentence, critical health complications and nasty medications while completely reversing all debilitating symptoms of heart disease and diabetes. The same after dinner ritual that mysteriously reversed every indicator of aging in ways that utterly defied what we've been taught to believe is possible in stunning ways that have sent world-renowned anti-aging doctors to stars and university research departments across the U.S. into humbling states of disbelief. A simple two-minute ritual that freed me from the overbearing stress, anxiety, and depression that had overtaken every waking moment of my day-to-day -day life, while rapidly restoring my energy and reviving my sex drive beyond what I remember enjoying in the very best days of my youth. And that's not all. My beloved sister, Lisa, who's been with me through my darkest days, including that horrific nightmare of my near-fatal heart attack, followed the same after-dinner ritual to drop a breathtaking 53 pounds of health-crippling body fat and 12 dress sizes in just weeks. Our family watched in sheer wonder and near disbelief as even her most stubborn, confidence-robbing fat pockets and cellulite vanished from her hips buns, belly, underarms, and thighs, along with her relentless back and joint pain that plagued her for decades. Her new youthful metabolism is now so ridiculously fast that regaining a single pound seems utterly impossible no matter what she eats because everything from bread, pizza, pasta, and ice cream is being burned like rocket fuel. And as unbelievable as everything still feels to us at times, all of this is because of a little two-minute ritual that I was inexplicably blessed, yet eternally grateful, to have discovered. An outlandishly powerful, health-transforming ritual that turns everything you thought possible about weight loss, metabolism, aging, and the human body upside down. It's exactly why I'm so excited for you to be here today. I'm honored to introduce you to Resurge the world's first and only clinically proven anti-aging nutritional protocol that cures the true cause of unexplained weight gain, stubborn belly fat, and metabolic slowdown. Resurge is the only product in the world that contains the eight special nutrients in the exact amount scientifically proven to dramatically improve deep sleep and enhance natural metabolic regeneration in both women and men. Let me be clear, there's never been anything like Resurge in the history of health. As myself, Lisa and thousands of everyday women and men can attest. Burning fat, totally restoring your health, and turning back the clock simply couldn't be easier or more automatic. Yet this breakthrough formula is miles more powerful than any amount of diet or exercise ever could be because it naturally awakens the true fat burning and regenerative potential that's lying dormant within you. Just take research before bed and let your own body naturally do the rest while you sleep. You can look forward to waking up to a leaner, healthier, younger, and way more energized version of yourself in the bathroom mirror each and every morning. Without having to change a single thing to do with your diet, exercise, or lifestyle. 
Every capsule of Resurge is manufactured here in the USA in our state-of-the-art FDA-approved and GMP, good manufacturing practices, certified facility under the most sterile, strict, and precise standards. Resurge is 100% all-natural, vegetarian, non-GMO, and completely safe and clinically proven to have absolutely zero side effects. You can get a one bottle, 30 day supply of Resurge for a simple one time fee of just $49. Yes, just $49. It's time to select your money saving package below and to experience firsthand everything I've talked about. 100% risk free today.